Good morning everybody, Lone Wolf Rick here. It is Sunday morning here in Las Vegas, about 10 a.m. And we're looking around here on the Las Vegas Strip. Seeing what's going on today on this overcast day. Kind of a little bit of surprise that it's overcast. It's supposed to get up to like 74 degrees today. Uh, yesterday was a beautiful day. And uh, today it should shape up to be a good day. Just a little bit surprised that it was actually overcast this morning uh, as we uh, sprung forward into today. Just see what I did there, spring forward. Hope everybody set their clock up one hour. <laughs> everybody ready for Selection Sunday? Big thing where they uh, select the 68 teams going to the uh, NCAA uh, tournament. It's always a fun time to see where your favorite team is going to be uh, uh, positioned in the tournament. And you know, there's always those two or three teams that think they should be there that uh, ends up getting left out. So always a fun, fun time. It's like uh, watching that show. Let's take a couple of things uh, just to talk about today um, as we kind of roam around here. It's interesting that uh, another jackpot hit. This one was at the airport, believe it or not. $328,000 at the airport hit. And of course, it's on a Wheel of Fortune machine. Wheel of Fortune machines this year have been on fire. Uh, as far as the progressive jackpots, uh, all of the major um, uh, slot machine jackpots uh, so far for the last four or five months have been on the uh, Wheel of Fortune machines. So uh, congratulations to the man from uh, California, I think was flying back home and uh, hit that jackpot. So congratulations to him. And uh, so maybe next time when you come to Vegas, it's like, you know, Put a few dollars in those uh, Wheel of Fortune machines and see if you can uh, maybe leak out like one of those progressive jackpots. I know I've never been able to, but you know it's not like it's not like I played a lot either, to be honest with you. So the Deuce bus pulls up here. The other one's uh, another big event going on. It's like or will be going on here in the month of May. Uh, they've announced that Tony Hawk. The skateboarder extraordinaire. It's like if you remember, uh, wow, this would have been what back in the late 90s. I'm trying to think when PlayStation One came out, and uh, you know one of the first big, huge selling games was Tony Hawk's uh, skateboarding game came out. So Tony Hawk has been an icon in the skateboarding world. But anyway, Tony Hawk uh, Weekend Jam uh, will be downtown. It's like a Fremont Street experience and off the Fremont Street experience. Uh, May the 12th to the 15th, a uh, huge festival, uh, which will include some concerts and uh, skateboarding competition, obviously. And uh, it's going to be held at uh, different locations throughout the downtown area. So this is a huge event. Um, three days, of, uh, like I said, the 12th to the 15th. And... Uh, yeah, it's, uh, that should be a lot of fun, actually. They, uh, uh, the music is uh, kind, of, kind of off the beaten path. It's like, you know, if they, like, they're, it's headlined by Devo, if you remember Devo. So, uh, should be a fun time. You kind of scan around here as we see this... Uh, Racing Cane's place, they're still doing construction on it, so it's not uh, it's not ready to go yet. I keep waiting. I mean, how long have they been working on this, huh? Now, I know it's like, this wasn't, this location was not a previous restaurant, so I'm sure they had to put in all the plumbing, all the piping, and, and everything, so... But uh, yeah, it's uh, 
we've seen inside it a couple times it's like it doesn't look like it's close to being ready to go but All right, well, I'm gonna kind of roam around the strip here and see if there's uh, anything to be seen. So get a couple of, uh, like the conferences to still determine their champions. So uh, sports books will be pretty full. In fact, I left when I started walking over here, I left over in New York, New York, and their sports book was completely full. Uh, people getting ready for the last few games that are going on today, so. Hope everybody has a great day today. Okay, it's like you look across the street there, it's like at the uh, outside of New York, New York, advertising St. Patrick's Day festivals. So that should be a lot of fun this coming Thursday. All right, everybody, it's like please take care of yourselves and stay healthy. And I'm gonna roam around here and see if there's anything else to uh, kind of find here. And uh, y'all take care. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.